Good evening. Smoking my LCS priors. Number 203. With some Northwoods. <clears throat> I got it earlier this week. And uh, did something to me that I haven't had in a long time. <clears throat> Gave me tongue bite. So I decided not to smoke any for the rest of the week till today, till the night. Because uh, tongue bite is not fun. So a little bit of biotin. That's a dry mouthwash, dry mouth mouthwash, oral rinse, whatever you want to call it. So I do that twice a day, three times a day anyway. <clears throat> And uh, Northwoods is like a glass of wine, fine glass of wine, or a fine glass of whiskey or, or bourbon. You have to sip it. If you puff it, it will bite you. No shop today, no shop for the past couple of days. I've not worked in the shop at all. Uh, except, well, I lie. I did go down for a little bit yesterday to cut some pieces that I'm working on, projects for a couple people on here. <clears throat> One of them, I'm halfway done, halfway through the project. It's a pipe tray. <clears throat> so I was down there for about maybe a half an hour, forty five minutes, I don't know. I'm trying to trying to get a hold of this, you know, um situation with my neck and my back from and the, the car accident really set me back so i'm doing what the doctor says and i'm resting and it's driving me freaking batty driving me nuts um it's kind of like you know i'm a go 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 guy I'm like, i've got to have something to do and today i went to physical therapy And the therapist reiterated what the doctor said and said, look, you're not even a year. December will be a year. And then they have to look at, then they look at where we go from there and everything. It sucks because I haven't been able to go hunting. I haven't been able to golf. I haven't, I did some fishing. Um, couldn't do a whole lot. Um, cause it just hurt too much. And the painkillers weren't doing squat. And I wasn't going to ask for more painkiller because then I'm addicted. So, this Northwoods is really good. It was a re it's a real shame I gave it away a couple years ago because I could have been enjoying it. I think a little bit longer than what I have been. But anyhow, back to my back to me. <laughs> So it kind of affects my woodworking. Can't. You know, I want to be in a wood shop. I want to be doing some of this stuff. There's things I want to make. There's projects I'm working on. Personal and for other people. 
So I will get your stuff done, guys. I will get it done. Um, it's just a matter of... I just need to take a couple of weeks and just, just literally just rest and not do so much. The doctor's kind of been getting a little irritated with me. Just a nice smooth smoke when you sip it. <clears throat> I was told there ain't more that you know. There's no more. You know, I, I'm I'm like oh, I don't, I don't want to have another surgery, and they said there's not there's nothing more you can have. You know, you got the most done that can be done. So. They worked the heck out of my scar tissue today. Oh my gosh. If I could show you that, if you go back on one of my old videos back from around December uh, 2019, um, you'll see how long the scar is. And I'll tell you what, man. She, I, was, I swear to God, if my butt cheeks could reach out and grab a hold of the sheet, they would, they would have been clenching the, the chair. Oh my gosh. I sit up at the end and they do a massage on my neck and today was let's work on the scar tissue day. Literally I'm holding on to the chair handles like this because she stands behind you and she works oh my gosh. But that's what needs to be done and that's what's been missing um, there hasn't been much scar tissue work and I've been you know asking about it and stuff so I'm gonna go when I go to my massage therapist next week I'm gonna tell her you, you need to work with scar tissue today was obvious But when you live in constant pain, when it's constant pain day in and day out, you can't be as active as you used to be, and it sucks. I'm only 51. I'm in I'm in great shape as far as weight. I'm at the lowest weight in years. You know, I'm in I've been doing my stretches. I do my the stuff they give me to do at home to build up muscle and. Uh, you know I can't play baseball with my buddies I, you know I can't play softball I can't like this weekend I'm going to a men's weekend with, with uh, our, you know a bunch of men stuff called the Builder Summit and our church guys are going and they're all going to be playing hockey street hockey and I can't play And that sucks. That really sucks. But when I made the comment, maybe I shouldn't have got the surgery done. Um, I got this look that they could shoot lasers at me. They would have. And it was a look of, you know, and he just looks at me and says, You wouldn't have much use of your left arm. If we hadn't done surgery. Because eventually we would have done the surgery. And. There's a. The more you let. The longer you let it go. The more damage. Irreversible damage. Is done. And then there's nothing you can do about it. And you have the surgery anyway. So. I'm thankful for that that at least I was able to get surgery done quickly because usually it's like a six to eight month wait they got me in fast 
Well, my neck was messed. It was bad. It was bad. He couldn't believe that I wasn't in more pain than, than I, you know, they were like saying, you know, doesn't that bother you more? Aren't you in more pain? Nope. And I wasn't. Breaking out the custom built. This video won't be that long, but I'm going to smoke some fireside. But that, that Northwood's definitely good. Definitely good stuff. But, um, you know, when you push hard all your life and you physically pound your body, the body pays a price. Um, I've done a lot of hard working jobs, you know, bouncing up and down the road in a truck, EMT firefighter, And then physically active outside of work. Um, my wrist had issues from the ambulance doors when I worked on the ambulance, where the the hydraulic in like your screen doors and stuff, the hydraulics. So you really had to slam the door hard. Well, that repetitive. That's what they call repetitive trauma. Apparently, that's what happened. That's what happened to my neck. I don't know. I don't know. I thought I did it driving truck. I banged my head a couple times off the roof of the truck on construction sites. I don't know. Anyhow, so this week I'll be up north with with men all weekend, I'm having a good time in the woods at a campground at a men's conference. Conference designed to teach men to lead and be men in their families. And in their communities and men of God. So, and I'm helping out. Build, uh, build a summit, Bible thumping wing that's the host. And he's a good friend of mine, and I'm helping him out. I go up and help work it and stuff. So, this is the second year for it. I went up last year. So, I'm going to enjoy that. Not going to enjoy the ride so much. Um, can't take much more than 30 minutes till in a ride and then my neck starts bothering me. So it's a two and a half hour ride. And I don't like getting in traffic anymore. My biggest fear is that I get in an accident and my airbag deploys. Um, and I'm trying to figure out a way how I can get it disabled on my on my uh, truck on the driver's side because God forbid if I'm ever in an accident oh it'll be bad they were they were the doctor was said that to me in the ER did you your airbag didn't didn't did it employ uh, deploy in us? I said no. He said thank God. He said it would have it would have tore my rods and pins. It would have tore them right out, and I'd have been I'd have been really I'd have been screwed. So driving scares me sometimes when there's a lot of traffic on the road. I get concerned. So I don't do a lot of driving anymore. I don't. 
I'm, I'm kind of afraid to. Um, I go local. And that's it. Alright, folks. It is a cool evening, as you can tell. Really cool. It got cold. I'm going to enjoy the rest of this pipe. Call it a night. You all have a good weekend. I might do a video from up there. Not sure yet. I don't remember how bad co coverage was bad last year up there, so I don't know if I'd be able to post anything from up there, but if I can do a video, I'll do a video. And I will see you all in the next one. God bless. God love you. I love you. Light him up. <laughs>